We start tonight with a persistent red tide bloom from our local beaches, also affecting the water in Sarasota Bay and an annual event usually expected to draw hundreds of boaters to our area over the weekend. Well, now that's been postponed from its original date. ABC 7's Erica Jackson joins us live from City Island to explain why Aquapalooza has been rescheduled for next month. Erica. Adam, good evening. Aquapalooza is an annual party on the water for boaters, and it's an opportunity for a nearby marina to showcase this waterway. But the party will have to wait until Sarasota Bay is clear of dead fish. Check out what Sarasota Bay looked like yesterday. Brown, murky water filled with dead fish and eel. Conditions have improved today. There's still discoloration in the water, but the number of dead fish has decreased drastically. Organizers of Aquapalooza say boaters come from Clearwater, Fort Myers and Naples for this event, and they didn't want them experiencing respiratory issues or get a bad impression of our waters. We kind of look at the reports from Moat Marine. We talked to a few people over there and we decided that just for the overall safety and the smell and atmosphere, it probably makes sense to postpone the event. Now you can look behind me. You can see what the conditions look like today. As I said, there is some brown water, but you can see behind me. There's really no dead fish in the water, so a big improvement from yesterday. Organizers think rescheduling Aquapalooza to September 1st is actually going to be a good thing in the long run, and we'll tell you why tonight at 11. Reporting live in Sarasota, Erica Jackson, ABC 7, your Suncoast News.